Now he also says this in uh, Matthew chapter number 23. Go ahead and turn right there quickly. Matthew 23 basically says the same thing about another passage here. Matthew 23 verse number 14. The Bible says, Woe unto you scribes and Pharisees, hypocrites, for ye devour widows' houses, and for a pretense make long prayer. Therefore ye shall receive the greater damnation. Now why do you think Schofield wanted to take this one out of there? Maybe because Schofield is going to receive the greater damnation. Because in his notes here, he says again, the best manuscripts omit verse 14. That it ought to be taken out of there is what he says. Listen, this man was a devil uh, from the very beginning. And this man is burning in hell because he not only placed these changes here, but then in other places, he changes the Word of God and what the Bible says. Now let's look at a few other places. In fact, in page number 6, let me just read this to you. Of page number 6 of his notes. And now I always wanted to say that. I always wanted to be able to say, turn to your Schofield reference Bible to page number six and this is what he says in his Schofield reference Bible on page number six in case you were ever wondering where the name Yahweh came from this is where it comes from C.I. Schofield says from which Jehovah or Yahweh now he just changed the name of God and added another name there. Where is it that these new versions get that? And the, this generation that's always trying to change the name of God. Hey, it goes back to Schofield. That Schofield has done this stuff. And listen, this is just a few examples. Now listen, uh, this man, uh, uh, Spencer Smith, that put out this video, he goes in that video and he starts talking about how that we post-trivers, we are conspiracy theorists first and theologians second. Hey, at least we're theologians, Spencer Smith. I mean, why don't you just get into the Word of God and read what the Bible says and see what the Word of God says instead of just going off of what you've always been taught. But you see, that's all these men do. And they can't give Scripture. They can't give the Word of God. And they have to try to deflect us onto something else because they can't answer us with the Word of God.